Uh, hey, what up? This is Mike Hoder here to talk to you about my new frame that just came out. My old bike hadn't been changed in so long that it's been about almost 10 years that I've been riding the same bike. No, no real different changes to it at all or anything. So we figured we could change it up a bit. The geometry was so perfect, we didn't have to change much. So that was a plus. But uh, what we did change was we lengthened the head tube to five inches. It used to be 4.6. And the standover used to be 8.75 and now it's 9.5, which is, I ride my seat post so high nowadays that like, it just kind of makes the bike look a little bit better. <laughs> Not, not so much like a scooter. And then I also have the uh, non-integrated non-integrated seat clamp so I can run the quick release uh, clamp on there now. And when I'm cruising around town, I can just sit down, do wheelies and fuck around and pedal and get from point A to point B. But then when I want to get down, I just lower that shit down. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. It's, it wasn't much of a change, but it just looks better. The colors it comes out in are yellow and clear in the beginning. Just for the first run, we're just trying it out, see how people like the yellow. I love it personally. I ran, I ran gloss for a lot of years. And now I'm real into the yellow. It's, it looks good. I also, uh, I also did the sticker graphics for this bike. In the past, I've had homies do them all. Homies in the BTM crew. I've had them do it in the past, but uh, I don't know. I just, one day I was just drawing some shit up and I figured out I could just I don't know, I just felt like drawing my own graphics for the first time and it actually came out pretty sick. It's, it's a little different, it's kind of hard to read, but when you do see it, you understand it, you know? it's Overall, the bike's a A1, as always, so. When you get a chance and they're out, I don't know exactly when they'll be out, but when they are out, go to the store, get yourself one, and it'll feel like the old bike, but just a little bit bigger, that's all. I just want to uh, thank s and Bikes for always helping me out and making the stuff that I want made. And It's awesome having a company made right here in America and you just be able to do it all right. You know, just right in front of you, you just have the whole thing done and it looks real good and it, you can watch the welders well and you can just, it's all right here. It's all American made, so that's pretty damn cool. And Thank you s and for that. And, and also Animal Bikes for helping me out over the last 10 years also, five years, I don't even know how long it's been. But yeah, thank you and uh, go get yourself one. Ride the hell out of it, fuck yeah.